Accounts Receivable is an integral part of any integrated business management system. The module tracks a wealth of information about your customers and provides essential tools for tracking cash expectations. Setup options are a key component of the flexibility of all the modules in Mass90 and Mass200 systems. Notice the setup menu contains all of the initial setup that I would do for the module, including bank code maintenance and so forth. In Accounts Receivable, I can set whether I want to use divisions or not, how I want my general ledger postings to occur, invoice printing options, and sales tax reporting options. Automatic invoice and deposit numbers are tracked here, as well as the fiscal year and period for the module. Select the open item or balance forward method for invoices, how to track aged invoices, and the aging categories. On the additional screen, I can say how long I want to retain my paid invoices in the system and how I want to do my sales tax reporting. I can retain invoice history in detail, summary, or not at all. Commission reporting has many options associated with it, including the ability to calculate on net invoice or gross profit. There are many finance charge options, including whether to calculate by fixed or percentage, and how to determine the minimum finance charge. On my integration page, I can specify whether I want to post various reports in detail or summary to the general ledger, as well as my audit selections. Batch entry is a great option when multiple users are entering data and you need to check and post their transactions separately. I can select to have credit card numbers partially displayed in inquiry screens and reports for added security. Finally, I can select the other MASS90 or MASS200 modules to integrate accounts receivable with. Setting these options carefully allows you to tailor the system to match your business processes.